Civilization of Sumer by Brian D., Emily M., and Jalen F. Pre-5000 B.C. People lived in the Zagros Mountains. They had to leave, though, because these mountains could not support their population. B.C. People created a new place to live called Sumer. Sumer is located in present-day Iraq, specifically between <coughs> the Tigris and the Euphrates River. Their leaders were priests and kings. They called their rulers NC. There are seven characters of civilization. Stable food supply system of government, highly developed culture, written language, social structure, religious system, and advanced in technology. The Sumerians had all of these seven characteristics. The Sumerians had a stable food supply. They grew wheat, barley, flax, sesame, vegetables, and fruit trees. The Sumerians built levees to trap floodwaters from the banks. These levees helped keep their land moist. The levees were, ju were just one of the many inventions and advantages they had in technology. They also made plows for their land and did some metal work. They had a system of government. Their government helped offer food for the poor and provide protection. They had a highly developed culture. And they created a lyre, an early version of the harp. They valued in their education, which included stories and the, wor the world's first book with a, with a very famous hero, Gilgamesh. The Sumerians used cuneiform as their written language. Cuneiform helped them communicate with each other and record things. The Sumerians had a social structure which today hasn't really changed. At the top of the social pyramid were the priests, rulers, and government officials. Next went the middle class, which included merchants and artisans. Below the middle class were the lower class, farmers and fishermen, which, no, uh, farmers and fishermen were in this part. And below everyone else were the slaves. The Sumerians built, built big ziggurats, which are like temples, where the priests and rulers would go up and worship for it, the people. The Sumerians worshipped naked nature gods because they could not control nature. 2300 BC. So, uh, Sargon. Around 2300 BC, King Sargon I led the Assyrians in conquering the Sumerians. This led to the downfall of the Sumerians.